So hello, today I'm going to talk about the design rule for TSG connector or Stoco connector and uh, the classes, how you can define the uh, classes uh, for TSG connector or your Stoco connector and how you can uh, merge them in the polygon. For example, if you have a polygon, say, uh, is having a net uh, net of ground and then um, the ground uh, pin of for example in this connector uh, how we can merge directly into the polygon without uh, thermal relief that's i'm going to show you so that is the i mean uh, i already did the video for this uh, diode for example the pad of this diode uh, reverse polarity protection diode how i've merged that here as you can see that how it's uh, merge in the polygon without any kind of uh, traces so so let's start it so for that what you can do you can just press on P and then polygon per select that and then drag your mouse to the right click till where you want and then here and skip uh, you will come out from the polygon pour mode then select this and then here at side you can open the properties of this polygon that you can do by going to the panel and in panel either at the corner you have panel and in the panel you have these properties either from there or from the view and then in the view you can go to the so when, when you will click here then the properties of the polygon is open and you can assign the net either by clicking here here as you can see that or you can also choose assign net from here so just let me do it from here so once you click here assign net then go on your layout and choose the net which net you have to assign to the polygon so i wanted to assign this net and then okay so the net is assigned let me report the polygon so here as you can see that the ground is not directly merged in the in the um, polygon it's connected through this thermal relief or through this uh, uh, traces so that's what we don't don't want and you can see that that this the dead copper is still there so that you can remove again go to the properties then choose here pour over all same net object and choose here remove dead copper and then again when you will report this so as you can see that the dead copper is the dead copper of the polygon is gone and only mm, um, the polygon is poured in your uh, board contour area <laughs> okay come back to this point so here what you can do uh, you can go to the design in the classes and in classes so classes are basically a group of uh, component you can choose the component in which group you have to place so that the specific rule which you will define for the pcb is applied for that group so like here as you can see that there are so many classes like component classes layer classes pad classes so the reason is that uh, for this is that you can apply the different uh, rules for these classes individual rules pcb rule i mean so let me here add one more class and let's call it tst because i'm having a tst connector which is called through hole terminal so and in this uh, tst connector what you have to do you have to shift choose the connector so here in my case x1 and x2 and then i have to shift this to the right side here as you can see that so now so now we are finished with the with the classes and then go to the design rules and in the design rule define the rule for this tht class component class for that what you can do you can go to the design open the rules and in the rules go to the plane and in the plane there is this uh, um, plane which is called polygon connect style and in that we can define how we have to connect our polygon to different component and so 
let me so let me add the new rule and let's call this uh, new rule as a tht <clears throat> okay and then here where the first object matches let's call this uh, here choose custom query and then here to the all nets and then in const uh, constraints we have to choose the simple one and in the relief connect style here you have to connect the choose the direct connection so that's how it looks like and then here in the rule you can define so it's a uh, the syntax uh, for the component class is in component class here as soon as you write in it will open component or component class and then it will if you have already defined the component class then it will show you which class and then you can choose here tst this is the syntax for the uh, for the custom query and where you have to apply you have to apply for the every object here in the where the second object matches so for the all here as you can see that then apply it will take some time to apply and then okay so now we are finished with the class definition and the rule so let me report this so here as soon as i report this as you can see that it has this uh, uh, ground pad or ground connector of x1 is directly merged in the uh, polygon without any kind of thermal relief and i hope that x2 ground is also so here you can see that this one this one is also merged in the polygon so that's how you can uh, define the class and uh, um, define the rule for that class for tht connector or stroke connector in your ultium designer um, for polygons i hope that this video is useful for you and if you like my content then please subscribe to my channel thank you very much